Hello everyone, this is Anything Third Person and welcome back. Uh, now, I'm playing a new game for you, it's called Life is Strange and it was released today, although it was supposed to be released tomorrow, but I, I, don't, I don't know what happened. Square Enix, one of my favorite game production companies, um, they tend to have really strange release dates for these games. Uh, I feel like they have no idea what they're doing over there when they when they release things like this. Anyway, so this is a game that was developed by a company called Don't Not Production and or Don't Not Entertainment. I, I think I butchered that. And those are the same people who worked on Capcom's Remember Me, which was a really fun game and I might actually do the let's play for that uh, in the future. But for now it's gonna be Life is Strange. So I played about a minute of it. I didn't really play it. I watched a cutscene for about a minute just to make sure everything worked. It looks good and I am really excited. Now I wonder if I can just refresh. I, I don't know if it's gonna start me in the middle of the cutscene. That would be bad. So I'm gonna just start here. Oh, so it's episodic and I believe they're releasing this in episodes to uh, similar to The Walking Dead. Now I'm not, I don't know if this is gonna be third person. I don't know if it's gonna be first person. I don't even know what the game is exactly, but it's got a lot of good buzz. Um, so I'm still kind of cautious approaching it but I didn't want to look at any gameplay footage just because I wanted to go into this this particular game I've had my eyes on it for a while and I didn't want to really ruin any of the story for myself so restart yes warning you lose all progress by all 30 seconds of watching footage life is strange is a story based is a story based game that features player choice the consequences of all of your game actions and decisions will impact the past, present, and future. Choose wisely. There's a comma spliced there. Alright, so we're in the game. And of course, we have to walk to a lighthouse. <laughs> because every single video game that starts with you having to get to a lighthouse ends really well. So ship doesn't help me run faster. Oh, actually it does. It does a little bit. But I want to just kind of look around. The texture work doesn't seem that great. But the environmental setting is pretty good. It kind of reminds me of Alan Wake. The Alan Wake's forest scenes, they did, they did a really good job of the environment in Alan Wake. Okay, yes, I know. Mouse to move the camera. Map. Okay. That was really helpful. Now, where... Where is the lighthouse? Is, is that... Oh, that's... That... <laughs> I was right next to the lighthouse. Holy shit. Oh, you, you cursed. Bad language. Okay, so this appears to be some kind of a tornado. Okay, Whoa. yeah. That was so surreal. Famously called film, little pieces of time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay, I'm in class. Everything's cool. I am okay. From light to shadow. From color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black and white? I didn't fall asleep, and that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller? Weird. Diane Arbus. There you go, Victoria. Huh. Why Arbus? Interesting. Because okay, so let's take a look at um, 
You feel like totally haunted the by setting the here. Of those sad mothers and children. Classroom. Yeah, she you can kind of see. I don't know if the 720p will and capture the image. Keep that to yourself. But seriously, though, uh, looks looks pretty nice. One of you in a dark it looks hand drawn, actually. You in a moment of desperation. And okay. One of you could do Enough that messing around. So let's look. What, what is? Oh, oh. oh Isn't that too whoa, whoa. easy? Okay, to drag eyes. to aim at the photo. And, ooh, what that's chose weird. To capture people at the height of and their beauty or innocence. Look at the photo? She what had the a hell? eye. So, she could have taken another approach. Oh, oh, to that look. Oh, that's weird. Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can yeah. hear the class laughing at me now. Oh, look at that. It's a terrible photo. I mean, who still uses? To admit, um, I'm not a big fan of her work. <laughs> unless you're I hipster. prefer Robert Frank. Me too. Okay. That takes he captured the essence oh, of I see. America. Okay, that makes sense. I was like, why Why would they put the text outside the circle? But it's... Okay. I get it. Let's take a selfie. Which why, why am I taking a selfie? Photographic in the Shh. middle of class. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, Who as you Max? all know, the photo portrait has been popular since oh, the early 1800s. Okay. Your generation was not. <laughs> Why did I just decide to take a selfie expression. in the middle of class? Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portrait oh, so has funny. always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth? to the first self-portraits. Oh, I'm Max. Max? That's that's the name of the girl? What? Why? Uh... You talking to me? You're asking me? L let me think. Um... You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. That's the really process oddly written. Out fine detail in people's uh -huh. faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait <laughs> so, the, so this entire Robert part of the Davis. game is me interrupting this guy's lecture? Is find that out really it? About him. If anybody else looked at this, what would they mm -hmm. think? Okay, page 8 of 8. Why can't I start at page 1 of 8? That's okay. I would read this and and I love to read stuff that's, you know, that I record because some people don't have the luxury of having good internet and they can't read, but it's just to save time, I'm not going to. I will pause briefly so that you have time to pause the video and then read it if you so wish. So there's page 1, June 10th, 2013. Page two. Uh, okay, she's leaving Seattle to go back to Arcadia Bay. Okay. Page three. <laughs> Shit is crazy with a K here. I didn't realize how much crap I had to pack. Blah, 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 blah. I wanted things to be different. Don't everyone. September 2nd, 2013. Oh, Blackwell sucks ass. Okay. Page 5, September 4th. Okay. Page 6, September 15th. Alright, so it's just a girl whining about school and how much homework there is and how much she doesn't like anybody. So basically, your typical story. September 23rd. Okay. Taking some shots around the campus. Mr. Miss Grant is cool. Okay. October 1st. October, my favorite month. Okay, so I, I skimmed very quickly and it looks like she moved uh, to this school to learn photography, it seems like. And she's not really liking it, she's not getting along very well. 
uh, classes are okay, homework sucks, and she wishes everything would be much better. So, yeah, nothing too unique. Max, that's me, I guess. Victoria was the little, uh, you know, a fine lady. Kate, who is Kate? Forgotten if I've ever seen Kate Marsh smile or laugh in the past month. She's really sweet and nice, even though the other students make fun of her abstinence campaign. <laughs> even, sorry, even if they act immature, everybody at Blackwell are seniors, not high school freshmen. She gets a lot of shit, in fact. I know she is involved in a lot of religious groups, but she doesn't preach to me, so I don't care. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. Basically a religious version of Max. Uh, okay, and I guess I'll unlock other people. Then there's Victoria Chase, blah blah blah, the popular girl who's also really smart and has clever quips all the time. Okay, I don't need to read that to know. And, uh, okay, so it seems like there is some kind of a system for stuff. Dad, have a very special 18th birthday. You're an adult now, but you're still our little girl. Check your account. Don't blow it all at once. On drugs. Kate. Hey Max, you around? Always. You okay? Did you want to get tea later today? Absolutely. I'll be free after four. T T Y L. Mom. Happy birthday, Maxine. We can't believe it's been 18 whole years since you were brought to us. X O. Okay, so Max is 18 years old. She seemed a little bit older, uh, her voice. Warren, make sure you check out Neck Romantic on my flash drive. Mwahaha. Hey, Mad Max, let's bust shit up. Wait, if I- wait, hold, there was more. Oh. Do you want to meet for coffee after school? I need an excuse to not study, please. Uh, wait, I have to study for a physics test, so if we bust anything, we also have to measure its velocity. Don't ignore this message. Seems to be a pretty persistent texter with no responses from Max. Sounds like me. <laughs> okay, anyway, uh, let's get a textbook or even uh, online. Oh wait, I wanted to look at the pencil you guys case. Don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly uh, out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure. Oh, that sounds and awesome. Start a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa get in <laughs> together. Sure. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. That teacher's really annoying. Oh, nice. So it is third person. Let's look at my notebook. Victoria doesn't waste a second. Even her school books are gift wrapped. I can't believe she made fun of me in class. What oh is she, no. 15 years old? And people laughed. Oh no, I'm gonna cry. Of course, feelings are Victoria hurt. has to have the bestest, newest, most expensive everything. Oh, well, what is it though? Oh, it's a tablet. Can I use it though? It looked like there was an option for me to use it. I should have known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. <laughs> it's a drawn tablet. I mean, it, it's kind of charming, but it totally takes you out of the, the scene. Photo equipment. Damn, they have carbon fiber tripods here. The ball head even has a pan lock. Oh my god, god like cuz such a photo nerd. Cuz pan lock is totally new technology. That printer is amazing. I'd love to see how it reproduces my pictures. I could pump out a whole gallery show with that thing. When I don't suck. Someday. Uh-huh. I actually had a question that was in the back of my head. Remember that selfie that she took? Uh, the first time, the, the very first photograph of her that we saw with her looking at a wall of photos. Who took that picture? She had a, she had a Polaroid camera. Who took that picture? Obviously Blackwell spent bank on the computers here. Looks like somebody was already working on this. Cool. <laughs> oh, that's significantly better. Okay, but I do appreciate the effort in hand drawing everything. It's I, I really like hand drawn textures. I don't know why. There's just something to them that makes them feel more like. He looks so sad and quiet today. Poor thing. Oh, Kate. Hi, Kate. Oh, 
Hi, Max. Oh, jeez, are you are you on drugs? <laughs> That was inappropriate. You seem quiet today. Just thinking too much. Okay. I'm gonna go grab a cup of tea. I hear that. Wanna go grab a cup of tea and bitch about life? Thanks, but not today. I have to go over homework. No worries. Let's hang later. Sure. Hmm. I want to throw out a bit of criticism right now at the script. Seems like they're trying to go for the whole real angle with teens uh, adapting. <laughs> look, at, look at the way Victoria's standing. Um, with teens in high school using foul language to talk to each other. And that's nice and all because it's real. But uh, let me look at this photo. Oh, God, it's so awkward. What did it say? What does it say? Something in amber. Oh, I don't know. Okay, whatever. So, uh, Victoria, Mr. Jefferson. Camera! Let me Whoa, steal Mr. it. Mr. Jefferson is not messing around with that monster. Oh, he that's what she paid said. 20 grand for that camera. I bet he gets pristine digital images. Mm, no, but Max, that's probably what the lens camera. costs. I okay. see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. And what if I do? I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Wait, well, what did he just say? That, that was really confusing, the way he said that. Um, do I have to? Do I have to? I just don't think it's that big a deal. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch-up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. Okay, great. Thanks for the inspirational uh, talk of nothing. Photo equipment, poster. Okay, I gotta get out of this room. This room is keeping me trapped. Although I, I do realize this is not a progression game. It's not a level to level. It's more of an exploration, but... Um, can I open this door? Okay, so the handling seems a little choppy. When you pan the camera, when you rotate the camera, I'm seeing just like frames. Oh, oh god, that's so weird. How cute I looked yet. I was about to. Like you you always Welcome to the real world. Hot. Then I might send you a special picture of Chinese class. Because Max wants everybody to see how hip she is. And she plays it so sharp. <laughs> I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. I hate that class, it's so fucking boring. Square Enix presents... A Don't Nod Entertainment. With probably exclusive indie music produced by a band that only plays three songs. A game entirely hand-drawn. Life is strange. Episode 1. Chrysalis. Chrysalis? Chrysalis. I don't actually know how to pronounce that word. Chrysalis? Alright, so who are you people? I think that's Courtney. She's such a slave to Taylor and Victoria. Oh, okay. I'm into that. There's Taylor, always waiting for Victoria. <laughs> that looks like, uh... Looks like Taylor Swift. <laughs> oh, no, okay. Let me follow the girl with a strut. Alyssa? Alyssa is always texting, but she doesn't hang out with a lot of people. Okay, maybe she's not texting. Evan doesn't say much to me, but his photos are very cool. Well, yeah, look at his haircut. He's obviously gonna have cool photos. 
Don't Smoke. Stella. Stella is always deep in her nose. She didn't come to Blackwell to mess around. Mm -hmm. I've seen Brooke hanging out with Warren. She seems like his type. Okay. Music's a little bit loud over the voice. I feel like audio balancing could have been better. Halloween party. I wish October would last forever. Then Halloween wouldn't come around. It looks like she's been gone for months. Oh, okay. Uh, missing from Arcadia Bay, date missing, Monday, April 22nd, 2013. Other, age 19 years old, height 5'5", five five, weight 110 pounds, blonde, hazel eyes. Uh, tattoo on calf of a dragon and a star on the inside of the left wrist. Don't need a PC, missed the Poetry Jam tryouts, and I did not steal that backpack. Uh, okay, you, okay, hold on, sorry. It, it's the the music is pretty loud. It's overwhelming. I can I can barely hear Max talk. Vending machine. Missing persons. Okay, so this does have a very gone home feel to it. Um, although gone home it had phenomenal voice acting. Empty, good. Nobody can see my meltdown, except for me. <sighs> what? Why are we melting down again? Are we just being uh, a putsy high school girl? Is that is that what's going on? Do high do all high school girls go through this? It seems like all the movies that have high school and girls in them like always feature like this petite, pretty like high school girl who is just like super awkward and then cries in the bathroom all the time <laughs> now who would bother to write that crap what does that say rachel amber is a bitch who's rachel amber does she look like a bitch uh how do i have my meltdown hmm <laughs> okay, I guess that was the melt. Oh, faucet, there we go. Oh, yeah, it feels so good on my face. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. It's a pretty nice picture. Fuck it. Okay. Still wondering who took that picture. When the picture. door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. That is true. I would know. I am a photographer. Photo! Photo! And it's overexposed. <laughs> That's what would totally happen. Whoa, why is a guy in a girl's bathroom? It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You, you're okay, bro. Just count to three. Uh -huh. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. <laughs> you're the boss. Well, now I'm scared. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. <laughs> That's my hella family, cash. not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! 
No! Oh. Well, the situation escalated very quickly. I didn't expect anyone to die so Whoa. soon. What the fuck? How? How can okay. that be? I was in the bathroom. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I remember. That poor girl. You don't have to recap for the gamer. Hand, <laughs> and then I was back here. I remember all of that. You don't have to tell me. I already me. heard this lecture. From light to shadow. Mm -hmm. From color. Now Kate is being hassled again. Yep. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Now, oh, shit. Can you give me an example of a Man, photographer? I cannot believe this. Oh, she broke her camera. Okay, if I'm crazy, I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Can I actually reverse time? Go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Hold right because mouse button to rewind. Oh, wait, <laughs> that's awesome. What? Why am I rewinding time though? Oh, oh. I did now, it. Can you I actually did it. A photographer who perfectly captured I'm a human the human time machine. I'm a human time machine. <laughs> Anybody? Okay, Bueller's I get it. Don't freak out. But I feel like she accepted Why that Arvis? pretty willingly. Because of our together, Max. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and When children. I took my selfie, Jefferson asked me a question. Uh huh. If he does again, I'll know this is for real. Keep that to so yourself. Is, is that what we're doing? Seriously, though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. And, and shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. I know I'm not dreaming course, this. You all know, the it's real. Has been I can since tell. The early 1800s. Okay. Your generation so I can go back in time. For selfie or you're high. What if that girl isn't dead yet? I resist. The point can I save her? Portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography. Really? Because I'd be more worried about that butterfly. Now, Max, in case you can get the perfect shot. Since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Really? I don't have the answer. To, <laughs> I don't have the option to answer? Uh, I feel like both answers will get me the same result. I'm sorry, but I really have to use the bathroom. Nice try, Max. But you're not going to get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me after class. And I need time to save that girl. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Uh -huh. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind again and give him the right answer? Okay, so this icon means you learned a useful fact that you may be able to use the if first you American. rewind. So... Hold shift to rewind faster. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you uh -huh. please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Sure. Oh, I like how you can't choose a wrong answer. The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Louis. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. <laughs> nice work, Max. The Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Okay, Max can so I? Far way ahead of oh, okay. Hey guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, Interesting. you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an everyday hero. Okay, I want to pause everything for a second here. Um, okay, first of all, it's it's very clever what they did. They are using a game mechanic to increase gameplay time using the same script. I think that's really clever. But they could have changed camera angles 
and to move. Uh, or something like that. I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. Uh -huh. I'd never let one of photography. Yeah, I, I've already heard this. Uh. Sh okay. I'm not avoiding, just. Biding time? Waiting for the elusive right moment? Exactly. Max, don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy <laughs> oh, making other plans. I hate this guy already. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. Okay. I press control to quickly undo your previous action. Why? Wait, why would I want to do that? Okay. So, uh... Excuse that was the wrong me? answer? Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. No, Victoria. Excuse us. I'd never let one of her talk... Okay, blah, blah, blah. Uh, oh, oh. <laughs> so basically, she's using this time rewinding superhuman power to sound more clever in conversations. Is that is that what I'm she's on top doing? Of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers. Good. Make sure you finish <laughs> working on it by today. I have faith in you. <laughs> Although, let's be fair, if I were in high school and I discovered I had this power, that's exactly what I would use it for. To have really clever things I to say to people. I hope I have time to get to the bathroom. Please, please. Okay, hold shift to remove faster. Anybody. They'll think I'm crazy. Nope, just gonna jog through the hallway. Nobody will think I'm crazy then. Uh, I didn't really check out the other environment, but I'll get to that. So, let's, uh, let's, uh, excuse me, can I... Excuse me. Uh oh. Okay. Ah, see, this is what they should have done. Step. You switch camera angles. You can still use the I same script, but keep things compelling. I shredded my photo. Then the butterfly flew in, and I took a photo. Uh huh. How come we never get to see that photo? Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am uh -huh. or who you're messing around with. Where did you get that? So, uh... What are you doing? There's a broomstick oh, here. Oh, down. fire. That's probably wow, smarter. I need a hammer to break it open. Oh, God, are you, you serious? Are to get in hella more trouble for this Looks than like drugs. Samuel forgot to take the cleaning cart out of here. Your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, Oh, that's convenient. There's a hammer there. Oh. Holy shit, I can't let this happen. If I can reverse time again, I can help her. Okay, okay, okay. Get that gun away from me, psycho! Alright, let's move this. Oh, shit! No, 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 Oh, okay, I was too late, I was too late. So, let's rewind. Don't ever, ever tell whoa, me whoa, whoa, what okay. to I'm so move sick this. of people trying to control me! Okay, going to get in hell take the hammer. Trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would okay, ever you're not affected by rewind. Hammer. Get that gun away from me, psycho! No way! Don't ever oh, touch me again! Oh, so when you pick up something, like a hammer, and you rewind time, you still keep the hammer in your inventory. That's interesting. Another shitty day. Is he really gonna walk into the hallway with a gun happen. in his hand? This cannot be real. I just saw a girl get shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? Do High school. freak out. Okay, well actually... I'm going to cut the episode right here. Seems like we've kind of explored the basic mechanics of the game and kind of know what to expect from it. So I don't know how long this episode is, uh, and I only have one episode available to me, but I will continue this on in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Life is strange, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!